I'm Cynthia Segovia and this is a question for Annie Buckley about her work I'm speaking. I would like to know if this is an invitation for people to participate and to take action or a reflection of the presidential campaign and what's the meaning of the beautiful and calm background on this artwork. Hi, I'm Annie Buckley and I'm responding to the question from Cynthia Segovia. Cynthia, thank you so much for your question. I really loved what you asked and the way that you framed it, asking me if my piece I'm speaking is an invitation or a call to action. And yes, I would say that it is. It wasn't initially conceived that way. It's conceived more um, in honor of and in respect for and in gratitude for that moment in the presidential campaign when our now Vice President Kamala Harris said multiple times during the presidential, vice presidential debate, I'm speaking. And she said it with such intention and grace and it inspired me so much and it gave me a huge breath of relief and just appreciation because I myself and I know so many women throughout the world have had that experience where you're talked over and you're not heard or your words are repeated by a male and then all of a sudden respected. And so when she did that, I feel like she did that for herself and for all of us. And it meant so much to me. So to get back to your question, I've now answered the second part. Um, it was about that moment, but it is also to your point a call to action and I'm so grateful that you see it that way. It meant a lot to me to hear that interpretation. Um, I hope it's a call for all of us, women and women identifying and all humans everywhere really, to speak up and to speak their truth and to not be afraid and not be pushed down by patriarchy and by these structures of power that do aim to keep us down and to keep our voices quiet. So that's why, that's what it's about. And the second question, why it's such a peaceful background, right? When we're talking about action and speaking up and, you know, down with the patriarchy. Uh, the reason it is like that is because I wanted this, these words to be a breath of fresh air, the same way that I experienced them when I heard, um, when I heard them spoken that first time in the debate, I wanted them to be a breath of air against this very dense mountain as is in, depicted in nature here of patriarchy and of these systemic power structures that do keep some people down or try to, and hopefully we are changing that. Um, so that's why it's done the way it is. The letters are cut out to create space, to have anyone fill that space with their voice. Um, and I also, in another level, wanted it to relate to female deities and the idea of Mother Nature and the idea that we are supported by this female um, spirit, spiritual space. And so I, I think in many ways the, the background is also echoing that. So thank you so much, Cynthia. I really loved your question and I love your piece in the show, your pieces in the show, and um, thank you.